Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Bethany. If you are new here, I create cooking, cleaning, and lifestyle videos here on my channel. If that is something that sounds interesting to you, I would love it if you would hit that red subscribe button and join my YouTube family. And if you're over on Instagram, connect with me over there. I will leave my Instagram handle here on the screen. I post a lot in my stories and I also post on my timeline when I upload a new video. So if you want to stay tuned and for more behind the scenes, definitely check out Instagram. Today's video is a pretty cool video. It is going to be a pantry clean and decorate with me, but I also had the chance to review a product from a company that had reached out to me. This video is not sponsored, but they did send me the product. The product they sent me uh, is from Easy Vallo. It's their Venus Brief Strip Light. It is a wireless LED battery operated strip light. You can put this in your closets, in your pantries. Um, above a desk pretty much anywhere so this product is very interesting to me um, and I wanted to try it because I've been looking for um, a light to go in our pantry for quite some time because once it gets dark in the house you can hardly see or find anything in there so you can see I'm unboxing it here um, it came in this Amazon box and um, this is like this is just what their box looks like from the company so you can see that here but this light is um, a slim and stylish design. It is as thin as one centimeter, so it's not very thick at all. It is made of polymer. The battery is easy for charging because it just comes off the side and then plugs back in. It's completely wireless. It is LED um, and it also has different settings for the light. So um, you can see me unboxing it here. It is going to come with a charger. It is going to come with the battery. Then it is going to come with the light and it is going to come with the housing mechanism, which um, just has a basic 3M strip on the back to where you can stick it to your wall, your ceiling, um, a shelf, wherever you are trying to put it, and it, the light actually mag magnetizes to the housing to hold it up. Um, so you're going to see all that now, but that's the battery I'm pulling out, and then I'm going to pull out the light, and the um, bracket or housing mechanism is going to come with it. So you can see everything here um, it is still wrapped up so I'm going to unwrap it and then this is what it all looks like unwrapped. It came in a very nice box, came with a charger and everything. Um, it also came with its user guide which is very basic and very easy to read which is nice. Some user guides are not that easy but this is the end that plugs into the light and the other end is just for your basic USB port and then this is the light itself. Um, I am really impressed by this light actually and this is the um, housing mechanism or the bracket um, it just magnetizes to the light so when I got it I plug the battery in red indicates that it is um, charging and needs a charge and then when it's done it will be green and you will know that it will be ready to use so now that it is ready to use I'm just gonna plug the battery into the light and you will be able to see that the light is turned on at this point. Um, it is motion censored so when it's dark in a room it will turn on um, and then you can see here there is a little button there on the side so if you tap that once it turns it on and off. If you double tap it it will stay on for 30 minutes. If you triple tap it that is always off and then if you press and hold it will be a brightness adjustment. Um, so you can adjust the brightness depending on how light or dark you want it in the room that you're using. Um, and if you leave it on constantly, it has four hours of constant use. Otherwise, um, if you are, you know, just using it for the motion detecting, um, it will have about two months of consecutive use being turned on and off. So I thought that was really awesome. So. My husband is going to show you here, he's just peeling off the strip to the 3M strip. 
he is going to stick this to the ceiling in our food pantry and it's literally as easy as that you guys i am so impressed by this product and how it works um he's just making sure that that is completely secure on the ceiling and then he is going to put the light on it and the light just magnetizes to it it's so easy it doesn't fall off it's very secure it'll turn on and off when you open the pantry and walk in so you can see it's still a little light in the house um, but you can see this is the before this is before the light was even hooked up and then this is the after so you can see there at the top it is a lot brighter and I'm gonna show you um, in another clip a few hours later after we had put this light up you can see how bright it is but I'm gonna show you here it is completely dark in the house it's about 8 o'clock at night I'm opening the pantry now because I want to show you guys how dark it is in here you can't find anything this late at night and then you just walk in and the light comes on and it's so wonderful it lights up the whole pantry you can find anything you need if you got the late night munchies and late night munchies are always a thing around here so it's really awesome for that I'm really happy that um, they let me pick this product to review for them I think that it works great I'm excited to see a future use of um, you know how long it lasts and things like that but now we are going to get to organize organizing this terribly dirty pantry I need to sweep and mop down here you guys can see that um, I had organized this not too long ago um, but year you know after weeks of groceries it just gets full and cluttered again so I'm just gonna go and organize it all and just make it look a lot more eye pleasing and um, easier to find things that I organized this um, a couple weeks ago I am just gonna go through and just reorganize things where I know they go um, put some pasta back in the pasta containers um, I do have bins in here and they did stay pretty organized but um, you know things just get thrown in there sometimes so I'm just gonna make it look a lot better I'm gonna do all of that here and just get it nice and tidy so that way we can find things put the brown sugar back you know, just put everything in an order um, so that way when you look in the pantry, you can just tell it's much better. Um, you can see here we got some lunch meals for my daughter, pistachios for my husband. All the cleaning products are off to the side and I forgot the empty box. Um, so we just keep this lunch stuff here. Um, there's some blueberry mix and then some stuffing behind that. Our oatmeal for breakfast is um, Nutri-Grain bars and fruit snacks for my daughter, more snacks for her off to the side, our canned goods and condiments. We have all of our nuts up here. Um, this is also like some boxed goods. We have a um, container of Oreos, we got some uh, brownie mix, a whole bunch of different stuff up there, and then all of our pastas, and then it goes into our baking, so our flour, sugar, baking soda, brown sugar, things like that. That is formula up there for my son, however he does not use that anymore because he is solely on breast milk. Um, but then it goes to our cereals and our oils and vinegars um, and our chips and stuff are stay up there too. It's just so much more organized and clean looking. Um, but now I need to tackle the bottom of this. We have an empty 12 pack of coke thing there that we need to get rid of and then just clean all of this out because the bottom of this pantry has needed a cleaning for quite some time so we are going to tackle that now. So now that I've removed everything from the bottom of the pantry, you can see how dirty the floor is. I know it doesn't look, you know, super dirty to some of you, but this is dirty to me. Um, and once I get to sweeping, you will see the pile of dirt and just 
miscellaneous things like onion wrappers and things like that that are in there um, but we're gonna get that all swept out and then we are going to mop it down there and just make it look a lot nicer and a lot more clean and fresh um, so for some reason a clean space just makes me so happy I think a clean space probably makes most of us happy but you can see how much we gathered from that so now I'm gonna hook a mop pad up to the mop and I am just going to mop the bottom of the floor but I hope that today's video is going to provide you some cleaning motivation um, to get a space done in your home or maybe to organize your pantry along with me or if you're just watching for motivation I hope that it'll provide you with that and just give you what you need to get up and get moving for the day you better grab that tambourine bring a base we might be with now that the bottom of the pantry is clean, I'm just going to put everything back in there the way it was before. I am also going to wipe down the inside of the door and the outside along with the door handles. When I said we were cleaning this whole pantry, we were cleaning the whole thing. Um, so now this is what it looks like after. It's so much more clean, you guys. It's, oh, it's just so much more organized too. I just... Oh, I love it when it's so clean and fresh um, and it's full because we just got groceries. So we have our grocery bags down there. We have some juice for my daughter. Of course, your potatoes and onions, our pop container, and then all of this just definitely looks more um, organized. I do want to get a different kind of organizer for like our canned goods. I really don't like the bin that they're in, but we are using what we have today. Um, but it definitely looks a lot nicer in here and you can definitely find things a lot more. So that is what I was working with today and it definitely turned out much better than it was previously. I just wanted to jump back in and say I appreciate you guys so so much for watching I hope this gave you all that you needed to get your day going also please don't forget to check the description below easy Valo is offering you guys 20% off of your purchase if you are interested in purchasing anything from their website they were kind enough to give my viewers a coupon code so I will leave that in the description box below again thank you so so much for watching I hope you all have a wonderful and blessed day and I'll see you in my next one bye y'all